Hi everybody and welcome back to Ibex Running. I'm Coach Rachel and today we have a 30 minute interval run for you. If you miss any speed or incline changes, I don't want you to worry because we're going to have all that displayed for you to see right over here onto your screen. And then if you look over onto this side, you're going to see this nice long progression bar and that's going to show you where we are from start to finish through this whole entire workout. Let's make sure we have a towel and a water bottle handy because we are going to get sweaty today. And if you're ready to get sweaty, let's Let's look down at this tread, find that start button, get it going in three, in two, and voila, and one. Let's go. We go two, five, three, five. Pick it up. Okay. I like this workout a lot. It's 30 minutes. There's only three parts to it, okay? 30 minute intervals, not 30 minute intervals, 30 minute full entire workout, how it's going to be broken up. Three minute run, one minute recovery, two minute run, one minute recovery, one minute run, one minute recovery. We do that three times in a row, and then we're out of here. It's gonna go by like that. I, I already know it. I obviously need to tell you guys I'm a psychic. I can tell the future. It's gonna go by fast, okay? So start, roll the shoulders down and back, in and out through your nose. We're going right into an incline jog. I think we usually start like this, so nothing like you're not used to it already, all right? So let's go hit that two on the incline in three, two, and one, and then we start a soft jog, four, five, six, five, in another three, another two, and another one. Okay, and so, I always tell everybody, don't really have to start. It's four, five, six, five on the pace. You don't have to start going six, five, right? We got two minutes on this one. Two minutes on the warm up. so slowly start adding on, okay? Maybe, if you're like me, it's frigid cold where you are. You can't just turn the body heat on, okay? Sometimes you gotta warm up the engine, okay? So take your time. Maybe every 30 seconds add on, beep, 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 beep. Point one, point two. Yep, we're 30 seconds in. I'm gonna add a little bit more. There it goes. We get to take the incline down. Oh, we go right into our first, we go to a walk after this. Nice. Shake out the arms. Pump those legs. So, in our, in our runs, in the intervals, the longer the run, the slower the pace, okay? So if you're having a little bit of a freak out moment, give me a little bit more on that pace. Four, five, six, five. If you're having a little freak out moment, get it together, Rachel. If you're having a little freak out moment, I'm about running for three minutes straight, don't worry. Slowest pace of them all. Two minutes gets a little faster. One minute fastest and the best news is you get to walk and recover between each round you're gonna love it okay so we have 30 seconds we take off the incline can you hear it my lungs just they're just not warmed yet okay i i need a sweater for the lungs people 20 seconds pick it up pick it up pick it up we go flat road Walk on an incline, 3040 in 10, in 8, in 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, good. Incline down, 3040. Just like that. Warm up. It's complete. Okay. I got to tuck my shirt, my pants into my shirt today. Ladies, even men, you got those leggings that are like, Extra silky, they just slide. <sighs> Come on, get it together. 2023, we can make leggings that stick onto you. <laughs> All right, get ready. Our first three minute run, it's a four, five, seven, five. Four, five, seven, five. So a lot of wiggle room, a lot of place to improve. So even in the first block, you can make block two and block three even harder. Okay, you can just have this one as a starting point. Just so you understand, that you can do it. 15 seconds, we get it going. Breathe, let it out. Here we go. Five, four, three, it's all on a flat road. Two, four, five, seven, five. Pick it up. So three minutes here, right? It's easy. And if you've been running with us, you know what I'm going to say. You know what I'm going to say. Three minutes to me is like the perfect amount of time because you don't have a, it's like a nice long run, but not too long, so you start stressing. Uh-huh, three, two, one. 
whoop, whoop, whoop. We should change that. 30 minute interval slash three, two, one. So you're already 30 seconds in. Good news is you don't have to run faster. You just got to maintain. And after this, we finish this three minute run. We only do two more three minute runs for the whole entire workout. I'm just setting you up for success here. Just telling you, take the pressure off yourself. You're okay. You're gonna make it. Good. It's starting to happen now, right? Ooh, the body tingles. Heat sensation. It's activated. I know. I, those first couple minutes, man, sometimes, I swear it's like 20 degrees out, 30 degrees out. 2023, I don't know why it's so cold this year. I'll never be warm again. Let's run, guys. I'll be running. I'll be warm. Just gotta run faster. You're halfway there. That's not bad. See? Yeah, okay. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. You good. Just keep working. Just keep running. And just like that, we're coming up. One minute, first interval, block number one. In four, three, two, finish strong, 60 seconds. 60 seconds, and then you get to walk. Walk and recover for a whole entire minute. So if you're newer, right? If you're newer to running, maybe you take it down. Maybe you push yourself harder on the runs and you don't really try to keep your heart rate up so high when you recover. Because walking at three miles per hour, walking at four miles per hour, completely different. Especially for me, one is just leisure. One is actual work, okay? Now, the first two, before we go between block one and block two, there's one recovery between. Maybe you wanna keep them high, right? The recovery, you wanna keep the heart rate up while we're still in block one. And then when we go from block one to block two, you take it all the way down. Just some options. All right? We walk 3 0 to 4 0 in five, four, three, two. So this is what I was trying to say. You can keep it a little bit faster here if you want to keep the heart rate up because we're still in our interval block, you know? Once we transition for that one recovery from block one to block two, then you rear recovery. You take it down all the way. And you just allow your body to just get it back together. But, so what I was trying to say, if you're newer, just recover, right? Take it all the way down, take it to that three. Allow yourself some time, right, to pull it back in. Get your head right, get your head in the game. You gotta get your, get your, get your, get your head in the game. High School Musical, come on. If they were right about something, you gotta get your head in the game. Zach Efron, come on. Let's go, 10 seconds. We go again. Two minute run, 5.08, we pick up the pace. Here we go, in four, in three, in two, let's go. I hope you picked up your pace cause we ain't playing today. Two minutes, two minutes we work. So it should be faster than, than the interval for that three minute run where we lost a whole minute, so we pick up some pace. I know. I know. Let's go. We're not tired, we're just getting started, okay? The work has just begun. Good news is, once we finish block number one, I only got 20 minutes left, really. And I told you this workout was gonna come by fast. So, Coming up on this first minute, right? The pace is fast, but it's not like a full sprint. It's just a solid run. <sighs> Should still be able to breathe. <sighs> right, you're not holding on to your breath. Keep going. One minute left. Then we take it back down to our walk and recovery. That's 3040. <sighs> Inhale through your nose. Exhale, let it go. Focus on the breath, that's what's important here. 
if you can control your breathing you can run for a lot longer okay it's when we start going out of our comfort zone we start losing the rhythm and then our body goes into freak out mode because it's trying to search to move and breathe at the same time and our body and our brain is like i can't so focus on the breath you're okay we are ready we walk and recover in six five four three two let's go three oh four oh all right got one more piece and round number one it's a one minute run the pace is right four five eight five we've increased each run by 0.5 losing a whole minute but increasing the pace by 0.5 so that's all i'm really asking for you to do obviously if you really want to push you can go to those higher paces right but it has to be a minimum of 0.5 it's only a minute okay you've already ran for three you've already ran for two a minute's just a walk in the park basically we got this but you gotta pick up the pace got to push a little harder and then after that that recovery is the transition one you can take it down a little bit lower hydrate towel off we do it two more times you ready for it five four three two five five eight five let's go five five eight five pick it up pick it up pick it up pick it up you're gonna make a minute seem like a millisecond after this so maybe you've only ever ran a minute at a time, but you just finished three. Three before, now you're back to one. You're like, oh my God, what was I even stressing about that? Ain't no problem. It's all mental. Running is a mental sport, 100%. 100% in my opinion. 20 seconds. You get to walk and recover, we get to start block number two. 15 seconds. Whew. Everything's better with the song. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 3, oh, 4, oh. So this is the one I was saying. You really need to recover. This is your moment here, okay? We're going from block one to block two. So we're back to our three minute piece. Again, the pace goes right back down. It doesn't slowly increase by each block, but I would like to challenge you to not go where you started on the first one, right? So say you were running four, five, seven, five. Maybe you started at a five. I'm not asking for anything crazy, okay? Maybe you just start at five, one. And then every time you increase, you've increased all across the board by point one. Small little steps, okay? That's all you need to do. You don't need to jump hurdles. Tiny little steps. Okay, it's gonna make you, it's gonna elevate. You're gonna get there. Whew. So don't race to the top, okay? Just little steps. Five, four, five, seven, five, four, three, two, pick it up. All right. Let's go. Starting block number two already. Start three minute piece. You're bringing it back down. Right now, your lungs are fully open. They should be fully open by now. The pace is slower. Now, just check, ask yourself, check in. Are you okay? How are you feeling? You're like, whoa, 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 whoa. Can you believe that this was the pace? If you're picking the same pace, can you believe that you were struggling <laughs> at first with this? Seems so easy now, right? That's what we're talking about here. That's what we do, come on. It's because you're nice and warmed up now, okay? So just keep going, stay focused. Stay hungry for it. Three minutes, right? It's hard because it's the longest. Also easiest because it's the slowest pace. So you choose how you want to look at it. Okay. We got one minute down. Two to go. Dun, 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 dun. And guess what? After this, I'm going to finish this three minute run. You only do it one more time. It's happening today. One step at a time. Focus. Again, back to your breath. How bad do you want this, right? This isn't a moment that you start to, to fatigue. 
you start to like slow down okay we're hungry we want change so be change keep going harder right don't allow yourself to quit because that's how it happens you allow it you say okay i've done this much work i can take a break don't do that finish you start the workout you hit start these were the numbers at least stick within the guidelines you'll be happy i promise be happy when you finish you stuck to the plan here we go one minute one minute left you get to walk and recover just keep running just keep working pump the arms landing soft on the balls of your feet not on the heels okay balls up your feet heels don't technically touch the ground Go, 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 go. You got 30 seconds. Pump it up, pump it up. Did you start faster? I did. Just a little. Just like I said, just point one faster than I did on the first round. So it's not even so much that your body can tell. This is all mental. I told you running's mental. Good. You have 10, 9, Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, take it down. Okay, we're here. Breathe. <sighs> Grab some water, man. Hydrate. Woo! I'm gonna do it. So, you're breathing. We're walking. Getting ready for our two minute piece and about another 35 seconds, okay? So again, pace increases by 0.5. So if you are following what I was saying, we're kind of increasing it at least by 0.6, okay? And then the next one by 0.7. But we're just following the numbers, 5080. 5080, no shame when you're getting, you don't add anything on, okay? If you just need hold, just don't quit time, okay? Just hold the time. We're doing it again. What that mean? Don't stop two or three seconds early. It all makes sense. It all adds up. Here we go. Three, two, five, oh, wait up. Pick it up. It all adds up. I swear. It's like when you like start coming down two seconds before, you get used to it, right? Wait for the number to hit. I never stop my, my treadmill early. I can't. I can't do it. Muscle on my head. I'm like, two seconds. I lost two seconds. <laughs> Come on, come on, think about it. Why are you here? What do you want? Why did you start running? I'm not gonna know the answers to those questions. Only you, so think about them. Why are you here? Why did you block out this time? Why did you start running? Why are you telling yourself not to give up and push, push harder, go further? You know the answer. So let's get it done, okay? There's no cheat code for it. It's not gonna just magically happen if you don't do the work. Never, nothing in life, unless you win the lottery. But I'm pretty sure you probably put in money to put in the work, okay? Nothing, especially when it comes to your fitness, right? You gotta do it, no cheat code. All the plastic surgery in the world ain't gonna make you physically fit. Just wanna put that out there. You have to do the work. Uh-huh, and it might look nice. Can they run a mile? Say to my kids, I don't care what you do. You just gotta be able to run a mile. <laughs> what if there was a zombie apocalypse? You gotta be able to outrun them. <sighs> 20 seconds. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Get ready. Let's take it back down. 3-0, 4-0, and seven, six, Five, four, three, two, two, three, oh, four, oh. All right. Coming into that one minute piece. It's the fastest, right? Fastest, fastest pace, shortest time. Uh, hydrate, towel off. We're almost there. About 10 minutes left. There's no secrets. There's no extra bonus round. You already know what's coming. 
okay? So going harder, going stronger. 30 seconds, five, five, eight, five. <sighs> Increasing at least by 0.5. If you are adding on 0.1, so you're making block two number, making it a little bit harder, just adding on 0.6, okay? You could add on even more. I'm just trying to get you to just slowly step into pushing yourself out of your comfort zone because that part is scary. That part is hard and that part ain't easy, okay? Let's go five, four, three, two, five, five, eight, five. Let's go. Let's go. It's only a minute. It's only a minute. You get to walk on the other side of it, okay? Just a little bit faster. Just a little bit longer. Squeeze that core nice and tight. Swing those arms. Relax the shoulders. And breathe. Guess what? You only have 30 seconds left. Let's go, let's go, pick it up. You ready? Whoop, whoop. Whoop, whoop. Feels nice, right? Not an aggressive run. A nice juicy one. I'm gonna call it juicy. Cause it's like, it is work, right? But I'm not stressed. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. All right, 3040. Now this is a transition recovery from block two to block three. So I'm putting mine down on the lower side. This is when I would suggest you, you hydrate, right? You could be drinking water anytime. For me, the less moving and drinking, the less multitasking I have to do, the better. All right, block number three, we start in 30 seconds. It's that four, five to seven, five. So if we're making, we're staying, you can stay where you are, keep the numbers the same. Just hold for three minutes. If we're making block three harder than block two, you're adding on at least 0.7. Okay, because you're added on 0.6 for the second one, 0.5 for the first one, at least 0.7, okay? It's only three minutes of your life, you only increase by 0.2. That's all a mental thing. It's all mental saying that you're scared and you don't want to do it. Let's go, three, two, one. Come on, baby. Come on, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. I increased mine. It doesn't even look like a lot, right? It shouldn't feel like a whole lot. And it's still, slower than your one minute run. So you see how it kind of plays out? It's a more comfortable pace. It's just a little bit harder and you're holding it for a longer time. First 30 seconds, it's complete. After this, no more three minute runs. We're literally in the home stretch here. Seven minutes left of this workout. Just stay focused. Stay hungry. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. Good. I love running. I love running. I know you do too, guys. I got stragglers. Ladies, you know that crazy thing you do whenever all of us are like, I think I want bangs. They don't do good for running hairstyles. Unless we all want to bring back the butterfly clips which they are making a comeback. You're gonna see me full 90s. I'm gonna have like the, the little black choker necklace, butterfly clips, a one size fits all shirt that looks like a rug. <laughs> I had it, okay? Keep going, keep going, keep going. We're halfway there, a minute and a half. I want to hear, what was your favorite? Let me know, because everybody grow, grew up in a different time period, right? What was the style for you? We should have like a, a lookbook, bring it back to a 90, what's a 90s workout, workout look? I think it's just like t-shirt and shorts. Like nowadays, workout clothes, phenomenal. When I was little, I just want to say, I think it's just spandex. A lot of capris, <laughs> capri spandex. Not the good capris, the ones that cut at the knees. <laughs> so you're looking like a half a chicken. 
The tricky jump stick. I don't know why it looks like that in my head, but it does. 30 seconds. Whew. Listen, things happen when you run. You just finish, okay? 20 seconds. But let, let me know. And then we can all take pictures in our time period of workout gear. I'm, like, I'm in for that. You got 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, walk it out, 3, 4, 0. We should do themed runs like that. Bring it back to the 90s, the 80s. <sighs> you guys, literally almost there. We only have three minutes of running left in this whole entire workout. But after the one minute, we go right into our recovery, and after that, it's right into our cool down. So 30 seconds we go. 5080. Remember what I said, so try to increase at least by 0.7, if you can. If not, minimum 0.5, okay? 20 seconds we go. But if you're ready and you're like, you know what, I was holding it back for round three, go for it. I'm not holding you back. I'm letting you off the training wheels. No helmet. Run. Okay? I also grew up in the 90s. They didn't have helmets. That was the thing. No safety. Three, two, one, let's go. Five, oh. Eight, oh. There we go. Bum, ba, bum, 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 bum. It's only two minutes here. That extra minute off is nice. So, what we're making, what we're losing in time, make up for in pace. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. Come back to your breath always, okay? And don't even look down at the numbers. That's what I'm here for. You have 90 seconds left. You are strong, you are tough, and you are not a quitter. So pick up the pace. Run it out. Good. Keep going. Keep working. Good. We have another minute and 10 seconds. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Let's go. 60 seconds. A little faster. Just a little. Just a little. Oh, good. Remember what I said. And three nose. Exhale, let it go. Just take it 10 seconds at a time. You only have 40, 40, okay? Once you get to that 30, 30 seconds left, piece of cake. And here it is in three, two, only 30 left. Don't stress out. Relax, okay? You're okay. 20 seconds. Come on up. Last 10. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. 10, you get to walk and recover. 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. Let's go, 3040. Listen, I just want to say, you got one minute. We go harder, right? 5585, last one minute. I already know that you're going to, you already know I'm going to tell you to go as fast as you can. Okay, and I'm so particular about telling you guys to push further because I had to do it my whole entire life. Nobody was there. Nobody's there holding my hand, telling me if you want better results, you gotta push harder. That's something that comes from within. And these are the moments right here that matter the most, okay? It's the tiny little moments that make up a bigger picture. So get it done, one minute. Go as fast as you want. It's the last minute we run. We go in 20 seconds. The ranges are 5.5 five to 8.5, but don't hold yourself back, okay? You will be happy when you finish. You get to walk and recover on that other side. We go on nine, five, five, eight, five, and five, four, three, two, let's go. We'll count down in tens, okay? So just keep running, just keep working, 10 down. See, it's not so bad. You got it, you got it, you got it, you got it. Just like that, two down, 40 to go. 
I know. Because after this one, only 30 left. 30 seconds. Come on. Let's work, let's work, let's work, let's work. You only have 20 seconds left. You can count with me on the last 10. Here we go. In another 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 2, 3, or 4, oh. Baby, three or four. <sighs> See? Complete. Mission complete. We did it. Okay? Just walk it out. You have one minute here. It's my pants slide down my butt. <sighs> the worst feeling ever. <laughs> Leggings. <sighs> Two, five, three, five. Because now they're sweaty, right? So when you're pulling them up, you're pulling them up like a garbage bag. Let's go, guys. <sighs> Last 20. We take it down, full cool down. Two, five, three, five. Another 15 seconds. Let's just, reca let's just recap, okay? 30 minute intervals. Every black was the same. It was three minute piece, two minute piece, one minute piece. Take it down, two, five, three, five. Right here, right now. Every block or every interval, we lost time. We picked up pace, right? We walked and recovered between each of them. Now, once you've finished, our secret emoji of the day, exclamation point, you know what to do. And if you're new, you only get this once you finish, okay? There's no cheating and skipping to the end. You have to actually do the workout. Comment this in to the comment. There's an exclamation point, okay? Just to know that you've done it. And then you can see anybody around the world doing the same thing you're doing. Remember, one team, one world, one group here, okay? So if you see anybody else, posting this you know they did the same thing you did they went through the same thing you did give them a little high five okay all love let's spread it let's spread the love okay 15 seconds exclamation mark i said point exclamation mark is it called exclamation mark and not exclamation point dang things i didn't know my whole life let's stop in three two Whoa! Cybex running. I'm Coach Rachel. 30 minute interval run. See you next time.